The National Treasury insists that its 2020-2021 budget is centered on three things. One, a reduced recurrent expenditure, two, reduced borrowing, and three, reduced deficit. Appearing before the Parliamentary Finance and Planning Committee, Treasury PS Julius Muya stated that the budget will be huge on austerity to save taxpayers' funds. Faisal Ahmed has more on this. Burden, Treasury PS Julius Muir told members of parliament that they had projected a reduction in borrowing to fund the budget by 4.9 percent. We are just cutting our cloth according to our size, just to make sure that uh, we don't have a uh, spurious expenditure that is not uh, useful at all. However, despite his sentiments, the government wants to plug its deficit by borrowing 345 billion shillings from foreign markets and 222 billion shillings locally. We are insisting that borrowing from the domestic market will not crowd out small businesses. The framework that uh, we had presented, um, I think early this year, uh, we got an approval for about 300 billion uh, domestic financing. Now, going forward, we have tried our level best to reduce that domestic financing and that is why we have a figure of about 200 billion. That is actually part of the reason why we are about to cut the expenditures because that expenditure is being cut to reduce the domestic power. According to Treasury, revenue performance will be boosted by the ongoing reforms in the tax policy and revenue administration. Kenya Revenue Authority is expected to collect 1.86 trillion shillings in the next financial year. Treasury has also lined up spending cuts across the government, warning budget officers that they now must measure up and be physically disciplined. Faisal Ahmed, Citizen TV, Nairobi.